boys 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 we are back i don't know what just happened up there if that disappeared for you but um so i just recorded this whole video um and apparently my mic was muted so that's awesome <laughs> uh, but yeah so last night arlington happened what the fuck happened uh cooper webb won which i hate <laughs> um Everyone was falling left and right, which I also, I don't know, makes it interesting. Fucking Sexton blows another lead, gets it back, chokes it. <laughs> um, Hunter Lawrence falls um, at the start, so that was pretty interesting. That was an interesting ride. So I don't even know what to do. Like, usually we try to pick one story and then click with it. But there are so many stories that I can't just pick one story. So I think I think we're just going to say, fuck it, and then we're going to ride with that ride in my knab. Um told you a story but I was muted last time how uh, there's probably like 10 uh, remakes of the Arlington track um, all of them like I think I went through five or six of them none of them were right um, even this this one's the most realistic one um, but it was based on the first version of the track and the first version of the track before that uh, over under it was supposed to be a single to go over the over under and uh, they turned it into a wall jump in the real thing um, so that's that and I haven't been able to make it yet um, so I guess we'll just get right into it oh and I also forgot to mention uh, I've been doing a lot of first person just because I think it looks a lot more real well it is a lot more realistic but and um, it shows shows how aggressive everything is on the track which I like so I think I'm gonna keep doing this even though it is a lot harder and I'm not good at it at all but uh yeah so like when I whip and scrub and stuff or lean it over in the corner it looks a I think it looks well a lot cooler yeah <laughs> and what's with all the falling like even in that like tunnel there was it Mosman? No, I don't think it was it Mosman. I think it was some gas gas rider. Just uh, washing it. Everyone was washing it everywhere. It wasn't just one spot on the track. And this, this is the section I was talking about that uh, it's a little different. You get the double and then... It was supposed to be that, but it wasn't. And I've yet to... I've made it one time completely over the... Over that... Uh, over under. So I laid on the downside. <laughs> that section's so fun. I feel like everyone was just having a gay old time on this track. But yeah, this is so <laughs> like, I don't know I don't know what I've said like in the previous video or what I've said in this video. It's just a nightmare. Oh boy, we're falling all over going all over the place. I love how the bots just aren't even any competition. <laughs> like, I don't, like this is a pretty straightforward track. I seen they're all, like they're all wiping out in the what? Oh, little lag there. Ah, okay. Um. But yeah, they're all just eating shit in the whoops, which is weird. I don't know why they're eating shit in the whoops. The whoops are pretty straightforward. But yeah, I can't wait till fucking Ken Rocks and actually get the dub on that Suzuki. I, I hope he does. Like. Um, yeah, no one's guaranteeing him that he wins, but like he's getting a lot better. Like he usually starts off pretty hot, so I hope uh, I hope he's saving them all for the end. He's pretty far down in the points, so I don't think he's gonna be doing anything uh, championship-wise this year. It's funny, I didn't even realize that my mic was like muted. Like, and usually that's the first thing I do when uh, I record one of these videos is check that my mic's working. That's uh, probably the most important thing in this, besides the actual video. Um, I didn't even realize cause, until I started playing Tony Hawk's. I'm like, oh, I should probably turn the music down because I'll be copyrighted. And, uh, oh, I should probably check my audio. And what do you know? It was muted. So really have like a checklist. Or like sticky notes, like mechanics do when they check the bike. They go, make sure the chain's good, make sure the oil's done, gas, whoa. 
There we go. I, I think this is my first time actually hitting this section properly. Oh, push myself way too far back and probably not even in frame anymore. Yeah, fucking Cooper Webb just weaseling his way in like I, I sent the Snapchat to all the, the guys that I was racing with and then or not racing with, like all my dirt bike friends. I'm like as if like that's such a Cooper Webb way to win. Just like he did with Ken Roxon when uh, Dean Wilson was in the way. Just snakes on in there. Also, I gotta ask, is anyone anyone getting uh, Supercross 6? Because I know I've got Supercross 4, Supercross 5. It's all like, it's all just a money grab. They're trying to reskin the game and whatnot. Like, all they do is really just move the riders. Like, <laughs> where, where they're supposed to be, type of thing. And then recreate the tracks. But like, oh fuck, I was supposed to dump it over um but yeah all they do is just really like remake tracks and then reskin riders but if there's like this custom like this custom feature is all right like has its ups and downs obviously like it's not just accurate track after accurate track as you've seen with my videos people can't get the scaling right but um there's some good tracks like i think this one's pretty accurate and uh Get, what, why spend another, what, 80 bucks getting a new one? I think the only reason I do it is uh, for the trophies, but like, I'm not really a trophy guy anymore. I remember back in the day, like, that's all I do is try 100% games. And now I just kind of play for fun because I can't play all the time. For some reason, they all stop there because it crosses over. So I get this huge lead right off the bat. <laughs> Like I'm saying, like I, this, this uh, custom track feature is not perfect. Definitely has its bugs. Because I am on the hardest difficulty, and I should not be leading this much on the hardest difficulty. Well, it has its ups and downs, I guess. Awesome shot. Yeah, how about how good did the Suzuki's look? Like I wish it had like the Renthal bars, actually. I don't know if an all yellow rental like uh, bar pad would look good. I like the teams that kind of um, mix a little bit of color and every like every kind of color into their bikes. Like, I think Pro Circuit does the best job at it. Like, they got the green, they got the the red unidized oil filter cap. Uh, they got the blue coolant lines. And then like look at this one, like there's yellow, the white, the blue, the red triple clamps. I think that looks pretty good. And then you got like fucking <laughs> teams like KTM where it's just uh, orange everything. Orange flywheel, orange triple clamps. Orange graphics off usually. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Yeah, so I obviously don't like KTM. <laughs> if you can't tell. I don't even like Honda or something. Like, obviously I'm a Honda fan. You got the blue show us forks, which I think they're like, they look so sick, I think. <laughs> and then, uh, but they're pretty, like, one color as well. Like, they got the red, oh. Oh, 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 oh. They got the red uh, top end, red triple clamps, red springs, but it's got, like, the blue, um, I don't even know what you call that. Blue forks, and then, uh, as long as like like the like on Hondas, I think if you put a red fly, um, yeah, red flywheel on, I think it looks so dumb. <laughs> I think there's one team that uh, does it in this, not like the factory team, but uh, like a privateer team. It's just like why? And also like this section in the in the real event, like that, um, it was supposed to be um, like in the real thing. It was uh, what was it? The single there, or the. What am I trying to say? I don't know. Like, the real thing that, that uh, was supposed to be. Oh, snap up. What is it called? I don't know. But, like, so everyone was scrubbing it. My one friend, I said, uh, my one friend, Mitchell Helmer, he's like, why don't. I wonder if uh, the 450s could just weed it around that corner, third gear, and then, it, like, lay, start, like, hit that jump, and then launch. In on top of uh, this uh, over under, like right here, and launch all the way onto the top of that. 
it'd be really real, like, it'd be, it'd be pretty unrealistic, but I'm surprised no one tried it, because even, like, the 250s, like, some of the Gettier guys were launching, um, launching it into, uh, the whoop there. Here, let's see if we can get it. Oh, I see bounced the hell out of that, and I hit the first jump so perfect. Oh, yeah, yeah, I think I, I don't know if I said this, but, yeah, I've only hit that once where I landed all the way over. And dumped it. Oh, we didn't crash. I like when we crash. I missed Twisted T Suzuki too. <laughs> I wish uh, Roxa was on that, but I think that'd be a conflict. Twisted T and then, uh, what is it? Where's the sponsor? Red Bull? It'd be quite the mixed drink. <laughs> Oh, I thought that I was done there. Like, there's no way I'm done. I'm actually kind of glad that the first video I had to make me because uh, the first, like, my base cam uh, here. <laughs> At some point in, like, you're right behind me. But, um, yeah, my face cam just decided to go to shit. And I had this, like, long... Like, I was just, like, thinking about it for a long time. Like, should I use, like, yeah, I just bought this, like, $4,000 Sony camera for, like, uh, for like the real life videos so I can make better edits. Um, I'm like, like, and to, to, to transfer to the computer, like it gives you like this wire and technically you could uh, live stream with it, the face cam, but I was like, should I use that instead of this shitty $150 webcam that I have? <laughs> I'm like, I probably end up will switching it. I think I just need, um, a tripod or something because right now this webcam's on my third monitor and it does pretty well most of the time also I love what Ken Rocks has done with the brand with um, Suzuki oh that was a sick whip <laughs> I didn't think I was bringing it back there um, but yeah like all like the people that I know or watch on YouTube they're starting to get Suzuki's like the Palmer compound and AJ Cotton Zero Hey, they are sweet bikes, but no one just bought them just because of the Kickstarter. But like, who really gives a shit? If you like, if you're just riding for fun, like if you're not racing. I actually, we have an '85 here, and I honestly, like, it just sat there like ever since. It got stolen, actually. Funny enough, it got stolen once, and it's a piece of shit. Like it's been busted forever. I it almost makes me want to rebuild it. Like I, and like get the gold rims on it and shit. Like it an R, like and uh, make it like an RC bike, or key car Michael, or even like a Ken Roxon bike, a '94 edition. <laughs> I think that'd be petty cool, but I think it needs so much work, and I don't know if I want to put put that much money into it. And it's only an '85, so like. What can you really do with an 85 when you're 6'3", 215? <laughs> you just blow the piss out of it, basically. I love how this track had so many crashes, even though it was pretty, it was a pretty basic track, and it seemed like everyone was enjoying it. Like everyone kind of was saying, like, "Oh, the dirt looks super tacky." Like, I feel like Arlington always is like that, like that kind of orange dirt. It looks like, it, well, it is super creepy, but it's also super slippery because it all gets caught in the and the grooves of the wheel. Because there was a lot of people falling and just kind of all over the place. But usually when people fall, it's like a certain s certain corner or a certain section that's slipperier than the others. But this whole track was just slippery and everyone was going down everywhere. Like under, <laughs> under the over-under. Like Tomac on top of the over-under. Sexton and the fucking corner. Woo! Oh, huh. I think actually if I would have brake tapped a little longer there instead of pinned it, I could have actually made it. And I don't think I've actually made it in this video. <laughs> I think it was in the last video that I uh, fully went over. Dump it! Yeah, there we go. <laughs> oh, I love doing that. Is that the third one? Points one. Total. Yeah, that was a little nasty. Who got second? Was it Rosen? 
It was Rosen. I thought it was funny. I think uh, the first time I did it, who was it? It was Brayton and someone else. But anyways, that's the video. Hope you enjoyed.